Well, Bill and Candace, a lawn care worker, says he's close friends with the family and says after watching our story air this week, it touched him so much that he wants to help get justice for the family by offering a cash reward. It's just a terrible situation. It's something Lee Nunnally never thought he would witness. One of his lawn care clients and lifelong friends, Sarah Ilzmalka, pleading for answers in the murder of her 18-year-old son, Bryson Mitchell. Just that he's not here. That's the hardest part. Mitchell was found shot to death inside a crash car on Gates Green Drive in Chesterfield back in September. Seeing how upset she was, it touched me. Three months later and still no answers. Nunnally says he saw Is Malka's interview with CBS 6 on Thursday and immediately wanted to help. And I would like to think that if I was in that situation and felt like hopeless, that uh, if somebody could offer some help, that they would. By offering a $500 cash reward on behalf of his lawn care company to help find the person who committed the crime. Nunnally says he has three children of his own and that his daughter was close friends with Mitchell. He was so bright and so loving and caring. And for somebody to just take him away, just to take him so early, like, you know, it just, it really is, it's a shame. And just hopes his small gesture will help bring justice to Ilzmalka and her family. It's not going to get rid of her heartache. It won't get rid of her pain. But like she said in the piece, she's just looking for justice. And I feel like she deserves justice. Now, meanwhile, Chesterfield police say they're still investigating the incident. They're asking anyone with information to give them a call. Working for you tonight in Chesterfield, I'm Matthew Foltz, CBS 6 News.